So if you're wondering why I'm doing this video at night, as I explained in probably another video you're going to see, why I'm doing it at night, and you're probably seeing this video in the morning, depending on if I post it, when I post this, I might get fickle and just post it like super late at night. Um, it was because I had done my first half of the vaccine. It's not because, oh, I was holding out and, and you know, and now I was forced to it. No, it wasn't like that at all. What it was was I had lit, have a very busy work schedule and I was just too exhausted to never go down and get it back, get just vaxxed. So I got my first vaccine shot finally. Um, I am strongly suggesting others, uh, I'm not trying to force anyone, but yeah, if you want this pandemic over as much as I do, um, <laughs> go, go get vaxxed, that's all I can say. I'm not gonna force anyone, I'm just saying, like, if you want this over as much as I do, just get vaxxed and help, you know, help out. Um, anyway, so we're not here to talk about it, but yeah, I was getting my first vaccine. As you guys know, there's some side effects. I was basically like, oh, God, this sucks. Like, I, I had, like, a small fever, my arm's still sore. Um, uh, I was, I was just not feeling good, and my arm's still sore, and, hey, be, a few hours of fever, of like a weirdo fever, is better than a sore arm is better than a than a ven being on a ventilator. That's all I'm gonna say. Um. Anyway, so we're gonna talk about a fun idea now. A little while ago, I I've been actually doing a lot of theme park videos, probably because I love theme parks. Um. And the reason why is because they're fun and they are great distractions, are they not? I think we can all agree. But recently, you know, with Avengers Campus coming out and, you know, with, well, coming out, I say already out, and Disney, you know, really pimping out the MCU stuff at their parks, I was like, what if Warner Brothers fired back with their own DC land? Like, what if instead of a whole land, like, this got, it got me to thinking, what if instead of a whole land, what if they did a whole ass theme park? Like, what if we got a whole DC Comics theme park, and what would that be like? I'll probably do a Marvel theme park at some point, but yeah, I figured DC, because yeah, I want to see Warner Brothers just kind of like one-up, want to one-up Marvel, I mean, excuse me, Warner Brothers one-up Disney to be like, oh, you have lands in your parks. Well, we well, guess what, motherfucker? We got a whole theme park. We took down six one of our Six Flags parks that wasn't doing well. It's probably the 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 Texas. Let's be real. It's probably if there was any um, Six Flags park that was going to be like taken down and rebuilt, it's the, one of the one in Texas. If you guys know what which one I'm talking about, then you agree with me. Um, anyway. So, so, uh, anyway, uh, let's, let's talk about this. Let's, let's talk about, uh, let's talk about some ideas for, um, yeah, let's talk about some ideas for this DC theme park. Starting off with, like, what would be the lands? Like, what would be these lands for this theme park, uh, for a DC Comics theme park? Now, I would kind of take a page out of like, um, I would take a page out of like Warner, excuse me, excuse me, like Disney and Universal, and in like each, there's an area, and each area is like a section of that land, is like a section of that city. So like one area would be Metropolis, one area would be Gotham, one area would actually be, uh, cent it would be Central City, and another would be instead of going to Themyscira, it would be like an, like a, um, well, you could say, well, Themyscira, uh, Themyscira is an island, so maybe you could say, like, maybe it's a, like a royal embassy of Themyscira or something like that, and, or you could just do, yeah, just do Themyscira to make it easier. Um, you could have, and another one would be Coast City. So those would be, like, your first few lands. Um, so yeah, you just got basically the three, ca the big, the big four for your first four lands. Batman, Superman, ba yeah, Superman, Batman, uh, Flash, Wonder Woman, Green Lantern. Big five, I should say. The big, uh, you know, your first five lands, and then do expansions with Aquaman and the Teen Titans. Definitely, that would be your next two expansions, would be Aquaman, um, because you could do Atlantis, um... 
and then you could do Teen Titans. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> that would be your next logical step is Teen Titans and Aquaman uh, to make it, you know, to make it all around seven. Because, yeah, there's enough story with all that, and you could do cool stuff with Atlantis. And then you could just have Teen Titans just be the animated show. Not Teen Titans Go, but, like, you could just make it and base it off of Teen Titans itself. Um, anyway, but let's, for right now, let's talk about, like, I guess you could say our Phase 1. Um, anyway, so let's let's talk about that. So our phase one, let's talk about each land, starting with Metropolis. Like, what would Metropolis be like in this theme park? The so Metropolis, uh, Metropolis would be a like a big shining city. You'd have like the Daily Planet there. You would have probably some restaurants. You'd have oh, dude, for restaurants, you gotta have Bo Bippo Bubowski's bar. You gotta have Bubowski's bar as a restaurant. That's just perfect. <laughs> like, you could have a walk-around character playing Bippo and talking, and, like, you could have him walking around and talking about times he met, he, uh, his pal Superman saved the day and stuff like that. You gotta have Bippo Bubowski's, uh, bar. That's just a given. Um, I would say, like, the ride itself would be in the Daily Planet, and I would say, like, maybe you could do the ride as, like, a Maybe like a 4D experience of like Superman fighting off uh, various villains at the Daily Planet or something like that. Um, I would even have like a ride center around like you would have a LexCorp building and have it be like another cool uh, another. I don't know what you could do with the ride, but definitely have a ride at LexCorp. And I think like it would the cool thing like I would what I would do. Um, uh, sorry, <laughs> my mind's just scattered. Like I said, I'm fighting through a sore arm. Um, I would have um, the ride kind of like the story would be like um, you're work, you're now interns for Lex Luthor, and you are basically being forced to test like various weapons, like a, like kind of like a shooting game, like kind of like the Spider-Man ride at the at Avengers Campus where you can you it's a shooting game. Something like that. You're like you're just testing various weapons on robots and robot supermen. Something like that. So there you go. There's just a few ideas for Metropolis. Um, so let's move on to Gotham. Now Gotham would be obviously a lot darker, a little more edgier, and um, I would say like the main ride would be Arkham at Arkham Asylum. Like the main ride would be something at Arkham where it's just this scary dark ride and like you would have all the villains there it would probably be like a treated like a breakout like yeah it's a it, like Arkham Asylum breakout and you're stuck there and Batman's trying to fight everything or fight everyone there something like that for restaurants and stuff I would say like maybe the penguin like the iceberg you've got to have the iceberg lounge as a bar uh, slash restaurant definitely um just yeah, that's a given <laughs> right I think we could all agree we could want the iceberg lounge there um, anyway so let's move on now to Themyscira so Themyscira again another you'd have a Wonder Woman ride I would make that kind of a boat ride actually I'd like to make that like something like uh, if you guys remember the ride before the frozen the frozen ride um, I f what was its name? It was it was in the Norway Pavilion of Epcot. Uh, if you know what I'm talking about, that's I would basically make it like a fun boat ride where you're going through Themyscira and you're seeing like animatronics of of, of the Amazons and you're talk and they're talking about the history of the Amazons and the wars and whatnot and it's all leading to Diana. Um, becoming a member of the Justice League. Like, it would be a story, like, it's a story being told to you by the Oracle of Delphi, who is on Themyscira. But that's just me. That probably would be not as exciting. I would have, like, a, one, a legit Wonder Woman thrill ride there. Um, probably a coaster. Maybe not a co Well, maybe, like, a Dueling Dragons coaster. Like, you could have, it like, one side be Wonder Woman and the other side Cersei. Something like that. Um... For the Flash, the ride would definitely be a, a, a roller coaster. There's no doubt about it. Like in Central City, it would obviously be Flash themes, and you would have to make it a coaster. Like it would be, 
just something like Rocket Ro uh, Rock and Roller Coaster or the Incredible Hulk ride, where it just shoots your ass from the get-go. Like, you were just launched, um, and you gotta make it fast. Like, that's the only way to go for, with a flash ride. Um, so, yeah, definitely. Um... So for Co so let's talk about Coast City. Let's talk about Green. Let's talk about the world of Green Lantern. Um, the, the how I would make that is like definitely make it with Coast City, or you could do like thinking about it now. Maybe you could make it based off of Oa, so you could do more Green Lantern stuff and have more meet and greets with like Kilowog or Sinestro or something like that. That would be kind of cool. Like the more I think about, it, it's like maybe not Coast City, but maybe. Um, Oa. Yeah, Oa would probably be the better one. And the ride would probably be, like, a fun, like, motion ride, kind of like Star Tours, so, or something equivalent to that. Just a random thought. Anyway, so, um, there you go, guys. There are my few ideas. I know this is, like, a quick video, but I was like, yeah, let's just do a fun little, like, theme park video. And... I was just like, let's just throw those ideas out there. And I'm always excited to see um, what you guys uh, could come up with. I'm really, as always, I'm really curious to see what you guys could come up with in the comments below. So tell me in the comments below, what kind of rides could you see at a DC theme park? Or what kind of areas or lands or rides? And what would you do with that? Just comment below, let me know. I'm really excited to see what you guys thought of this. Um... So yeah, just comment below, let me know, and once again, I am Mr. Multiverse, and I will see you next time in the Multiverse.